Tony, back in action tonight, cup competition. What does the, the Durham Challenge Cup mean to you? I know you've took the other two cups seriously this season. Um, so what, what do you think tonight offers? Um, same really, we, we, it's, it's an important competition. We, we're going to feel a strong team, as strong as we can, effectively after the game we played the other day. Um, we want to try and keep some cohesion with the, with the squad, so it'll be very similar. Um, in terms of the cup itself, you know, we're four games away from the final. Um, this is game number one for us, so let's, let's do it properly. Yeah. See, last season you, you got into the, I think it was the, the second round of the, of the competition. Are you looking to sort of advance further this year? Have you got the squad to do that and, and compete in all in all, all cup competitions as well as try and be up there in, there and about in the league as well? Yeah, well, uh, I suppose it's a quite a prestigious cup competition. They've got some good players, good squads in it, you know. Um, Ricky Sanchez is in there. Um, I think Gateshead went out in there, so but it is quite a prestigious cup where you've got some big teams. Spenio's still in, you know, who, who beat us last year. Um, but I suppose that's down the line, you know, we've got a game tonight that we, we need to win, we we'll have to win. And it's, it's usual one game at a time, but that's fully focused on fighting. Do you know much about the opposition that you're facing tonight? Not a great deal, no. Um, we have, we've tried to do some research. Um, I found clips on YouTube, I've spoken to a few people. Um, but I suppose it'll be a case of sucking and see, you know, we'll, we'll set up with with the plan, you know, and, and see how we go, but we might have to adapt pretty quick, depending on what they like. Um, we'll make the lads aware of that. Just finishing there, Tony, uh, before you go and uh, get the lads ready for the game. Last season, you you um, very much kept a lot of clean sheets. That's an area that you focus on. You're very strong. Is that something you want to get back, your team back in, in terms of get, getting those clean sheets? I think I think that comes with um, just playing well. I, I think. Some types of games this season we haven't turned up and played very well. Um, I think for me, I'd rather just get us playing well again and then take care of itself. Um, the pride's still in the lads, you know, so to, to keep clean sheets, the pride's still in the score goals. So yep. I suppose once, once we're firing all cylinders um, regularly, then that'll take care of itself. So it's not, not an issue. Great. And uh, just one last question there, Tony. A couple of fans have, have mentioned it over the last uh, week or so. A couple of players have left the club on, on loan. Can you sort of explain your decision around why you've, why you've let those players leave? Yeah, yeah, so Stevie and Kiros have, have gone out. Um, we need to look after people. Um, it's important that we, we look after the human being and, and the person, you know. Um, we're a football club, we want to win games, but people need to be tracked right. Um, I spoke to players at the beginning of the season, explained that when we got to October, if we weren't getting the minutes in them that we needed in them, then we'd look after them and get, get them out and get some minutes. Um, that's what's happened. Kiros is young, you know, he's he's right on the fringes for us, like really close to, to starting games, not being involved, um, but not quite making it yet. And I think a little spell out in, in um, playing some regular football it, in a league where it is quite com uh, competitive and, and robust, will do him the world of good. Um, and he'll come back to us a better player. Stevie needs some minutes, needs some minutes, and he's gone to a good side where we're playing well and, and attacking well. So, um, I think you'll, you'll get some good minutes over there and, and do really well and come back to us fit and strong. Brilliant, and all the best tonight, Tony. No worries, cheers.